love bugs is rustling back at you one more again i hope everybody is doing blessed i'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you and if this is your first time stopping by my channel much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs my grown extended beautiful family just thank you so much for you know just supporting the channel sending so many love you know so much love that way as you know i send it back and it's truly a blessing that you know our community is you know really growing rapidly so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe hit that notification bell so you know when i'm about to upload my next video also if you uh, are comfortable enough please drop me a line or two i love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how you impact your life and how it's gonna send you to a positive have you going towards a positive direction i got tongue tied my bad y'all <laughs> but anyways if you feel like the video has been very informative to you and gives you good vibes uh please go ahead and share with loved one family or friend or even a fellow empath that needs validation or confirmation towards their life path or even their life purpose and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit and thank you once again for the love and support i love y'all from the bottom of my heart and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today i'm listening to uh meditation music in the background is meditation to cleanse your mind body and soul positive energy bath raise healing vibrations that's the reason why i got tongue tied because I, I knew i was feeling something there today y'all it's, it's just been really crazy today um let me turn this down so i'm not over talking um it's twin flame 101 hey Oka's major shift has occurred you've worn out your welcome to your old life and you truly have it's just like we're we're up on a uh a soul renewal there's a lot of things that's been going on like every, some certain things is feeling off to you might be a little bit energetic as well as drained at the same time which i truly am i'm really pushing through this and plus i just finished eating so i got the itis so i'm just going ahead and push through you know the message needs to be a message so um going through all these different changes you know um you probably getting reoccurrences from your past life there are certain things is you know showing you snippets of all the things that are going on you know we're we're having recycled energy that's going through and everything like that people been border jumping coming off of uh spiritual flus you know having these migraines like crazy right in the middle of the you know in the third eye uh you're probably um you've been going struggling through getting stuff done this for your old life you've probably been getting signs left and right that new doors are opening for you new doors of opportunity new doors of blessings are coming through but you worn out your last you are wore your your last leg out of your old life and they are pushing making you go through it so you know you're going to be going through a, a uproar of different changes as well as shifts going on this week uh you know i was talking to a couple of my my love bugs today and you know and just letting them know i mean are you feeling something you know you feeling something's off you getting you know a vertigo type feeling you know all these different things are going on they were like yep and you're like what do i do without you i'm just hey i'm just the messenger so going through all these different things and being able to uh i know my my gift is like took a major upgrade so your gifts whatever your gifts are that you know i told y'all a lot of us are multi-gifted if you feel like you're only one gift like a, just an empath or just a hayoka no try again you got to be quicker than that <laughs> you got a lot more other gifts some of them are just kind of dormant until it's that time you know they don't want to just load everything on you all at one time because it's already you know enough as it is dealing with a spiritual awakening so whatever you're you know you're trying to heal from whatever you're you know they're wanting you to acknowledge they don't want to throw all that on you at one time but the energy has been so strong that it's pushing and pulling so it's just like you know you've been getting messages if anybody you know if you look at numbers pay attention to the numbers like i do uh you probably get been getting like seven eight between seven eight nine the numbers or five 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 you know anything like that you know i always try to make sure when i get the mirror numbers uh, like I just said, mirror numbers, and it said four, four, three, four. You know, either seven, you know, seven, uh, both ways. So it's it's just really been interesting. Being able to do this is truly a blessing to me to be able to help others along the way. You know, like I've told y'all before, but there's new people coming through. Um, it, it can be a, a scary situation on having, you know, these 
ascensions or kundalinis or spiritual attacks or spiritual flu you know thinking that you're about to lose your mind having nervous breakdowns going through straight panic attacks having heart palpitations all these different things you probably have your heart chakra has been vibrating you know your crown chakra has been vibrating all these different things is letting you know there's like there's things coming through for you you have to be able to pay attention think of everything that's positive even though you might be having a hard time dealing with you know situations that you're going through but they're not going to be lasting you have to keep telling yourself that you know that your current situation is not your final destination if you've been like working like crazy which I know y'all probably have you know and trying your best to be positive at everything they know it's hard you know they understand that but you have to be be able to believe in yourself as well as in the universe that better things are coming that way but it's just like there we have been wearing our welcome out in this old chapter <laughs> so they're like you know what you ain't gotta go but you gotta get the hell up out of here so basically you are going through so many different changes that is occurring right now um when i was getting visions earlier today i was like okay soul renewal kept on hearing soul renewal we're going through these things it makes you feel hyper as well as refreshed but as well drained because it's like it's just recycling all the energy you've got so it's kind of push pull so it's going to feel a little bit draining so it's just like when you know that you're tired of dealing with the situation that you're dealing with it's winding up you know i hear that winding up emotional uh situations ending to a old battle uh y'all have been going through trials and tribulations left and right you've been struggling with a lot of things that has happened traumatically in your life um you know i suggest you do a lot of uh meditations if you can um nature walking smudging if you can as well you know going through all these different things you got to go through changes and uh know that things are occurring for you but they're going to occur for you you know in the best way possible so just know that better days are on their way to you you know you have to be able to think positive you know we're going through all these different changes you know i was like really emotional yesterday you know like going through it and it was just like i didn't know where it was coming from i knew it was my my emotions but it was like probably built up things that i'm going through and you know just need no it was day before yesterday not yesterday but day before yesterday you know you can you can tell the universe like you're tired of going through stuff you know you've been doing the things that you need to do you know uh, a lot of your uh past memories might be coming up you have to be able to allow those you have to say these are no longer mine you know i set free from whatever is holding me down you have to really tell yourself that ask the universe for help if you need to you know a lot of things might be reoccurring that you probably forgot all about and you might be struggling with it but you cannot be engaging in those past memories anymore you know those are like i've told y'all before uh, any of those things like that is like distractions because darkness and the devil does not want to play hand in hand we already know we're gonna win anyway so you know the devil be trying to play dirty <laughs> so he be trying to put things in your way so you know when you're heading towards blessings you know old memories will come up that you forgot all about but you already say you already got to say these are, these are no longer mine i place them up under my feet or you know i part ways with them you know you have to be able to say tell yourself you can't engage in those things anymore so allow yourself to go through what you have to go through yeah it might make you feel a little bit irritable at times you know uh, or a sense of calmness like right now I have a sense of calmness but it, it feels like a blessing too anytime I can be able to help anybody put understanding towards their journey or any extra information that they need you know it's like universe is always guiding people towards me for me to be able to help others you know it's a scary situation to go through these things and you don't know exactly what you're going through you have visions you have feelings that you know I'm not part of here. I, I you know people want to put me in a box, but I don't belong in a box. You're not supposed to be in a box. You're not supposed to be ordinary. You're special. You know, you're that special gift. You know, you had to go through so much hard times. You know, like I tell people, we have to go through it to get to it. They always put the strongest soldiers through the toughest blessings, uh, toughest trials, toughest battles. You go through those because God already know He got confidence in you, saying you won't get this. You know, it might take you a minute, but you're gonna get it. So allow yourself to be able to see yourself as that victor of overcoming your crazy circumstances. Allow yourself to know your blessings are a lot bigger than the, than the trauma that is keep coming back to you. To, you know, wave this little ugly head. You know, tell them. You know, 
ignore them like it's a bill collector, like you don't want to talk to them. <laughs> so you just go ahead and do it that way. But know that what you're going through is for a positive purpose. You know, it might be a little shaky right now, but you also got to remember that you're cutting generator, generational, uh, what is it, generational curses and karmic karmic cycles so you're gonna pick the most they're gonna pick the most hellish situation to place you in just for you can be able to heal through all those things being able to see your blessings being able to forgive and just allow yourself to be able to love you have you have to part way with things with love you know i had to remember that going through that stuff with my family being able to know that hey you know yes these people put you in this situation Yes, they tried to do above and beyond to try to make sure you would not make it, try to bring you down, but they're human. They go through things. It happened. It happened. I just pray for folks like that. So, you know, going through all those different things is, you know, it's been a life-changing blessing for me to be able to know, I, you know, things that really sent to, you know, what happened in my life had, you know, really put me in a, a messed up place, but being able to separate myself from that, saying I'm stronger than what happened to me, you know, you have to go through certain things just to be able to realize you're much stronger than the things that people try to put on you, because they realize you, you got, you got strength, because they don't want you to, you know, they already feel like you're, you know, you're, you've got more strength than they want you to acknowledge, because when you acknowledge what you have already, what others see in you, that's a scary process. So allow the things to come through the way they're supposed to come through. Pay attention to your visions. You probably, you know, are spacing out a little bit. You daydream or whatever. So write down your daydreams. Write down the visions that you get. If you have an intense, you know, dreams, crazy dreams, um, write those down as well. So I hope you are able to relate to, resonate with the video. So now as much love and light. Give me a thumbs up. Let me know if you resonate with this video. It will be greatly appreciated. Um, and I will give my post notifications. Shout out to K Dropping Gems. Much love to you, sis. Hope all is, is well. And Keith Bush, much love to you too. And you know, I said, drop me a line. Let me know if you resonate. Like and subscribe. Thumbs up. Share. And send out as much love and light and pos positivity as you possibly can. And I'll see you on my next video. Much love. Peace. Be well.